Hi, I'm Peter Ma. I thought you may be interested in this clip I found on YouTube. It shows a vehicle that has a blown head gasket with white smoke, steam and water coming out of the exhaust. This is typical of a head gasket that has been breached or blown above one of the combustion chambers. This level of smoke normally only happens when you start up an engine after it's been sitting for a while. The reason for this is that whilst the engine is running, the combustion chamber is developing about 150 kPa of combustion pressure, while your cooling system is only producing about 16 psi of vapour pressure. The high combustion chamber pressure pushes the radiator water away from the breach and pressurises the cooling system. This prevents any more coolant entering the combustion chamber, which stops the vehicle from smoking. However, as soon as the engine is turned off and the combustion chamber is no longer producing pressure, but the cooling system still is pressurised, the radiator water will dribble unimpeded through the head gasket breach and into the combustion chamber. But when the engine is restarted, the water and glycol in the combustion chamber turns into steam, water and white smoke again, as shown in this clip. And once the wet combustion chamber starts to fire, again and the combustion gases purge the water and glycol from the exhaust system, the white smoke and steam go away. But the next time the engine is turned off, the process will repeat itself. This level of smoke would indicate a small hole in the head gasket that would be easily fixed using Liquid Intelligence 245. The success rate of using Liquid Intelligence 245 on this type of repair is very high, and faced with an expensive mechanical repair, Liquid Intelligence 245 is certainly always worth a shot.